you, I am talking to you, we see you talking to you, I am talking to you, I am talking to you, I am talking to you, we see you talking to you, talking to you, I'm talking to you, talking to you, I'm talking to back on, but I ain't sounding back on. Yo, yo. There you go. I am Solomon tearing these streets up out here, boy. Trying, man. Just, you know, just in, in, enjoying the sport, enjoying the culture. Mm, I got a question for you, Iron. All right. What at this point is actually pushing you forward right now? Is, is it the fact that you're winning? Is it the fans, the fans are falling in love with you again? Is it the competition? Is it the money? Um. <clears throat> I mean, all, all that all that stuff is a fact. It's factors. All of it helps. But honestly, like, I, you know, I, I sat I sat out for a little while, and when I when I was like, I, I was really tuned out when I sat out. Like, I wasn't really watching battle rap. And then once I once I tuned back in, it was just so many people that was just so fired, taking the taking the craft and the culture so seriously. It just got me excited to just participate. And then, you know. Honestly, it's like before <clears throat> the way that I came up. It's like if you rap, you battle. Period. That's just what it was, right? And and all of us, you know, I'm sure, you know, Danny coming coming from the, from a similar era. It's like you you're aspiring to be a rapper. Like you want to you want to be a rapper, and part part of being a rapper means you know having punchlines, being in ciphers, but then also having songs and making music. And and so the battle thing was like a stepping stone to just just the whole package of, of what it meant to be a, an MC, And now I'm just at a point in my life where like, I'm not really pursuing that whole, that whole thing like that, where I'm like, yo, I'm, I'm a, you know, I'm selling t-shirts and I'm, I'm doing booking tours and, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm in the van on the road and I'm, I'm, you know, I got my mixtape and this, this and that, like, that's just not where I'm at in my life. And so instead of back in the day where, where I would be like fighting against, a stigma of being a battle rapper and, and trying to like turn it into something else. Now I'm just like, yo, like why, why was I throwing out the baby with the bathwater? Like just because, just because it can't be everything you ever wanted it to be. Doesn't mean that you have to disregard this thing. That's really like, it's, it's real right now. You know what I mean? Like people really care about this. People are really tuned in. And so I'm just having fun, bro. Like, it's, if if I lose a battle, it doesn't mean that my mixtape ain't going to sell or, you know, I don't get a record deal or whatever the fuck other pressures there is. Like, I'm just I'm just trying to do great things in, in the culture, and, like, I'm not trying to fight against any kind of stigmatism or whatever the fuck it is. Like, I'm just here to just, just try to be the best that I can be and, and – be great in this culture. And right now there's, there's so much greatness, yo. like there's so many people that are so good. And like that, that's really what inspires me. Like my peers are what inspire me the most. You know what I mean? Like just pe- people like Danny, people who, who take this shit so seriously. And now there's fans that take it as seriously as, as we do. And like, I just love that shit, bro. Like I, I love it. Like there's no, there's nowhere else where I could take a craft or something I care about this much to the extreme that I'm able to take it to and have people give a fuck. You know what I mean? Like mm-hmm. we we write the sh- we write the shit out of these bars, bro. Like it's not it's not easy. Right. It's not it, it's hard. It, you know it's 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 a real it's a real craft, man. Like it's this shit is rocket science for real. Like you know what I mean? So Fact. where else can I where else can I geek out that hard on some shit that people really give a fuck about? You know what I mean? I see that, man. You're coming off a classic with Pepper Jones. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah, shout shout to Chiller, man. That's 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 my bro too, man. He's Danny Chiller. Like these these are guys that really really you know played a big role in in inspiring me to come back just by seeing you know they seen other people that care about some shit as much as I do. You know what I'm saying? That's being, that being as good as they are. That means a lot to me, man. Hold on, let me wipe, let me get the Kleenex. I gotta shed a tear on that one. <laughs> like that, that means a lot, you know, for Iron Solomon to say, you know, guys like me and Chilla inspired him. Like that's, you know, and he's, you know, coming from where you came from. That's just legendary shit to hear, you know, as as a fan. Not the fan in me is talking. You know what I'm saying? And it's dope that you know my peers recognize, you know, what we are doing. 
Yo, I just can I, can be, I play I mean, something I mean, real for fast? Me, like when I when I when I when I when I see you, I see myself. You know what I'm saying? And and I just I just listened to an interview where I listened to a whole bunch of shit that I ain't even know. But you know, you were somebody was digging you up crazy about just putting other people on and like that that type of shit is like that shows the kind of genuine love for for the culture. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Right, I appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. You know, it's it's only a few of us left, man. It's only a few of us real MC, like real battle rappers. They're like the original yeah, ones yeah. left. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. We we might not have the star power and this and whatever these other imaginary things going on, but when we talk about the actual craft of the skill of writing, it's only a few of us in that elite level. And you know, you've been cooking since since the MOOC battle. You came back. You know, the disaster shit was crazy. I mean, you've been getting crazy with everybody. You know what I mean? That's, you, it's, just, um, it's amazing to see the run you're on, and I'm ex- I'm excited to see what you're about to do with uh, Surf and Big K. I actually got you winning both of those. Yes, sir. But you know what, man? <laughs> the the clash is coming. You know you know who your real test is. You know who your oh, real test know. is. That's why, I'm, that's, why I'm, that's why I'm trying to butter you up now so you go easy on yeah, me. Yeah, it's coming, bro. It's coming, man. Everybody been waiting <laughs> on it. Me and you been talking about it for like three years now. It's, it's finally time to go ahead and get that in, yeah. man, because the, the, I want to see you versus Lux. I want to see me versus Lux. You know what I'm saying? Like, now it's like yeah. we, we got to see each other. And then, hey, I got a, you know what I mean? Yeah, 100%. Hey, hey, hey Aaron, I got a question for you, Aaron. I need to cut you off. Like, like, what's your thoughts? All right. Now, I hear, I hear what you're saying. Battle rap is thriving. There's a lot going. You got people like Danny and Chilla. You got people giving it their all, but what about the downsides of battle rap? How do you feel with the choking, the, the, the cycling bars? Like, how can we eliminate that out of battle rap? Is there a way to, to eliminate that? What do you say? What type of bars? Right, like, like this, people choking in rounds. And, I mean, I mean, how can we hold people up to good performances? We're gonna work on that on, on, on August eleventh. We're gonna we're gonna work on that. We're gonna we're gonna try to work all that out. Sometimes you just gotta flush the, flush the system, you know what I mean? Okay, I got you, I got you, I got you. I got you. This shit right. So alright, so let's let's get into it. All right. So so you got serve first. And then you got you got big K you got uh big K a week after. So as for surf, how did that battle actually come into play? Oh, uh, I was just just you know, uh just shitting on him on Twitter and then um people got excited about it, you know. I think people like liked the back and forth that we were having and so the powers that be um reached out and, and put it together, you know. Oh, so it was that simple. Yeah, I mean, you know I feel I feel good. I feel proud of myself because even just a year ago, like I could have gone at surf all day on Twitter and nobody would have cared. You know what I mean? So I, I feel proud of myself that I I've, I've been able to claw back to the position that I was in. It's like it's hard to get to that level. Period. Let alone get knocked all the right. way down and and come back. So I had to make obviously I had to make it worthwhile where people care that I'm shitting on surf on Twitter. Um, but really, it was it was just like. I you know I think I think he's excited about it like I think I think that he you know when I spoke to him whatever whatever you may see from his actions you know sometimes actions speak louder than words whatever it is like he's talking about he wants a classic you know what I mean like that that's what's important to him like the the check and the classic like so I think him him responding and people being interested in it and him being interested in it, it's like it just made sense. You know what I mean? It just made sense. Mm, okay, okay, okay. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. I, you, yo, you got two tough opponents coming up because both of their bats are somewhat against the wall. I'm kind of yeah. to the best surf that I've ever seen, to be honest with you. But I'm not, I'm not yeah, so. choking in the third. He's not going to choke in the third round. You know why? Because he's going to look crazy. It's going to be no excuse. I'm not expecting none of that. I'm expecting him to come on fire versus you. Yeah, I hope so. Definitely. Uh, 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 so if he comes, are you worried about the star power? Because Surf has a lot of star power. You and Danny would just talk about I, I've seen Danny mention it. Like, like, how do you overshadow that? And do you feel like you have star power? I mean, for me, I'm, you know, I'm, like, 
I, I'm a fan of everybody, you know what I mean? Like, I could be really critical. Like, when you're when you're a fan, you're also really critical. Like, you're going to be – I'm going to criticize J. Cole's album more than I criticize Lil Pump's album because once you're, once you're in this realm of – somebody who's on that level, that's when I'm going to be crazy critical of you. You know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. so, but at the same time, everybody that I've gone against and everybody that I want to go against is somebody that I, I respect and appreciate at least one chamber of what they bring to the table. Like, I, I think that, you know, Sir, Sir has moments of greatness in his writing. He has a lot of garbage in his writing, but he, but the, the star power piece of it and the, the charisma and the, and all that stuff, like you you have to respect it. And to me, you know, again, just just the era I come from, it's like you, you're supposed to have all chambers. So if I'm going against somebody that has has something that I feel like is, they're stronger than me at, like I'm gonna try to, I don't try to avoid that or dance around it. Where sometimes people will be like, "Yo, you're not gonna like, don't go aggressive with rock or whatever the fuck it is. Like don't don't try to out punch be magic like." I'm not just trying to win battles. I'm trying to prove to myself that I'm I'm trying to have fun doing this shit and prove to myself that like I can do that. Oh, oh, you do that, I can do that. And and I also look at it like like these days for me, it's like a feature to me because like I'm not really doing music like that, but what it, but if I sit back and I watch somebody being great doing a battle, it's like, yo, I, I want one of those. Like I want to I want to I want, it's like I want to do a record with this person. I want to collaborate with this person. You know what I mean? So whatever Surf has that he, he you know, whatever his Beasley voiceover, um, you know, <laughs> credentials are, like I'm trying to I'm trying to rise to the occasion. You know what I mean? Like I'm, I'm trying to do the best at what I do that I think he can't do. But then I'm also trying to step into his chamber because just as an MC, like that's, that's what I want to do. I want to figure out if I could bring that to the table. I want to push myself to be great in the way that somebody else is great because, you know, that, that, that's what inspires me. That's what's pushing me is to, yo, I, damn, I want to, I want to punch like B magic. So I want to battle B magic and see, and try to study him and then, and go against him. Not because I want to just defeat him, but because I'm a fan, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. As, as far as all right, as soon as the battle was announced, what was uh, pretty much the reception? Is it is it mainly you winning? Yeah, I mean, I've seen a lot of that, but I think everybody's timeline kind of um, distorts reality a little bit. You know what I mean? Like my my timeline is going to favor me a little more, and I'm sure that his timeline favors him more. You know what I mean? Um, I see people. I see people. You know, I think people are going off of his last his last few and so battle rap has short memory you know what i mean I, I've, I've seen a lot of people having me winning which I, I i don't like because i feel a little more comfortable being an underdog i, I was happy when people really was doubting the rum nitty battle but I, I see enough i see enough negativity around it to 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 you know to get me in that zone i got a question for you are, are, are your goal to beat surf or is it to beat your last performance or your, your, your last best performance um, it, 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 honestly, it's always both. It's like always both for me. Like I'm, I'm. There's no opponent that I would just like take light because I thought it would be easy to beat them. Like that shit is corny to me. Like I'm not. Like I said, I, I'm really not here to just like. Oh, I, I'm just gonna win a battle and then move on to the next opponent. Like advance. You know what I mean? Like go, go up the pyramid and advance in the bracket. Like that's that's not the goal for me. It's like I'm trying to create those you know chilla chilla rum nitty type moments. Like that's what I'm in it for. Like, I'm not trying to just win the battle and then move on to, to ball rock or whatever the fuck it is. Like I'm trying to fucking be great, do some great shit, contribute to the culture. So like, I'm, I'm definitely trying to at least live up to, you know, my best moments ever. I'm trying to always live up to that or always beat that if I can. And then at the same time, also, also beat that person. You know what I mean? Because I mean, look at me and Mook, like that, you know, that's not like a, Mook's not really celebrating that win, you know what I mean? That's a fact. Let me ask you a question. Do you watch that battle? Be honest. Nah. Why would I? Why would I, why would I want to go through that? Again? He said why. He said why. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I, I, mean, uh, I mean to see the growth, to, to see what you were doing wrong, like that. Or yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I mean, I haven't. I, I've seen. I've seen pieces of it, but um. But yeah, I mean, I you know I have a hard time watching myself on camera. It's tough sometimes, but I, I definitely 
I, I, I make myself do it because you got to, you have to study and you have to, you have to learn. You have to learn from mistakes. You know what I mean? Uh, all right. I was just asking about that. So, so that, so I'm gonna say that battle right there. You definitely trying to beat that performance, but I don't mm-hmm. know, man. It, it's gonna be hard for you to be out doing yourself because you dropping some good ass battles, man. I'm not gonna lie. And we're all, it's gonna be a lot of pressure on you. This battle, not, not, not too much. I mean, you from that era where niggas battled fucking freestyle on the spot that you didn't know who you was battling, just you just knew it was nice as hell from the neighborhoods, et cetera, et cetera. You know what I'm saying? So it shouldn't be, it's not that much pressure on you, but the fact that you're doing so good and your part and Surf has been lackluster, not saying he's whack, but he's done it to himself the last couple of battles. So the reason why fans are reacting to what they are, fans are going to look at it like Iron should be buying him, not Surf fans. But I mean, real battle rap fans who's tired of the bullshit, tired of seeing the jokes. Like, we, like we're looking at it like, yo, I ain't going to fuck this nigga up. I know it. I'm yeah, that, 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 that's 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 where the pressure that's where the pressure comes in because I see people, yo, you know, get him out of here for the culture. Like that that that's where a lot of it comes in because now you have people that not only have really high expectations, but they they want you to speak for them. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And like. That that's always tough. That's always tough because you you're trying to, you know. I mean, I think battle rap battle rap is is psychology a little bit. Like I think a lot of battle rappers like first of all, there's the psychology of knowing what a fan wants to hear and being able to write something that somebody's going to react to. That's that's really being very much in tune with with the human mind and the human thought process to be able to be like, yo, they're going to go crazy for this. Like most people most people can't really do that. Like. Um, just just get into somebody else's like headspace like that, and then on top of it, when you have somebody who's kind of in a villain role, it, it is a little it is a little tough because, like you said, it's like well you're you know you're supposed to, you know Batman is supposed to win in the end of the Batman movie, you know what I mean? So if, if he doesn't, it's kind of like oh come on man, like so there's definitely there's definitely pressure there. Damn, I'm just sitting here thinking, man, you freestyle, you rebuttal, like you you can fucking rebuttal half a round. I'm I'm really I know Surf gonna try. I know because I don't I don't wanna look at it like, yo, I ain't going to throw this nigga and then it's like closer than I thought it was and now we're looking at you a certain kind of way, cause that's how it happens too. You know what I'm saying? Like I already know he's gonna bring it, but I just don't see it, bro. I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't yeah. see it. I see what, like the street shit, okay, I got it. But his first round versus Rum Nitty, I thought it was dope. Now, if he, if he come with three fire rounds, cool. the second round I thought was kind of like, I know everybody else liked it, but I think that's what the guys came in at. He's not going to beat you with that second round. Yeah, I, I thought, I, I, like, to me, I liked, this, I liked the second round while it was happening. You know what I mean? I think a lot of people liked it while it was happening. And then when it was over and we got a chance to really, like, let the dust settle, it was like, you know, we, we were able to pick apart all all the, like, kind of big flaws and a lot of outdated shit or just, you know, made up made up words, made up dogs that don't exist and stuff like that. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, I mean, I, I hope I hope you guys are best, bro. I think, like, I mean, I, I feel very lucky that pretty much everybody that, um, that I've, you know, had the honor to, to go against since I've been back has really – you know, paid me the biggest compliment that they could by being at their best. I mean, I, you know, Charlie Clips was a dying man before he, we battled and he had three full rounds, like fully written, fully memorized rounds. And same thing with B Magic. B Magic had been choking like crazy. You know, people were over, people were over him, you know what I mean? And But Iron, he was rapping about your testicles. Wasn't that awkward? <laughs> yeah, that's that's awkward. That's awkward. That's awkward. But but three rounds, three rounds is what I'm saying. Three rounds. And and magic was, magic was, um, magic was. People wrote him off, and they were like, "Yo, what? Like, who even cares?" And then we got like the best B magic that we've seen in a while. You know what I mean? So, and and I'm telling you, wow. say, like, yo, Iron, you really are getting people with their backs against the wall, bro. When that B magic yeah. battle. Happened, that was the week after the whole URL shit. I remember that now. Charlie Clips, right. he was all Charlie Clips because he kept bullshit in every battle, so we had to bring it with you. You really are getting tough-ass opponents when they back is against the wall. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, I want people at their best, you know. Like, to me, it's not it's not really a win. Like, 
you know, beat the Bulls like the year like after Jordan retires. Like you don't want that. Damn, this is kind of crazy right here. This is kind of yeah. Crazy. I'm telling you, Kate, Kate, yo, Kate's gonna be fire. Like, I, like everybody who's like writing him off is they're bugging. Like, I don't. No, nah, I think Big K going to come with it. Big K don't, listen, Big K don't got a choice. Number one, I feel like uh, we can get into Big K now. I feel like he's kind of being rewarded. Now, don't get it confused because I know everything he did on King of the Dot. I know he was doing something he just wasn't on URL. What he has to understand is the whole time we were saying get back on URL, that you can come back, and now you're not holding up the end of the bargain at all. It's just like what the hell was the point of everyone saying they wanted to see you on URL for? If you, like now you're looking vulnerable. Yeah, I wish he him. hadn't done that. I wish he hadn't done that just in general because as a fan, like, you know, there's so many matchups that are so good for him on URL that it's just like now it seems like that's never going to happen. You know what I mean? Like it seems like it just seems like a waste. Like I, I would love to see him versus Rock. Like since since, since right. he kind of came out, I was like, damn, him versus Rock would be crazy. Like I think everybody who really like, like understands the science, like as soon as they've seen him, really getting his bag, like, they were like, yo, like, him and Rock would be crazy, and that, and now it's like, man, like, you know, yeah. it's too bad that it went that way. Yeah, no, um, no one. I, oh, yeah. no, I was going to ask him. Uh, with them being a week apart, um, how far are you in terms of preparation? Like, do you, are you done writing for both, or are you done with one and still working on both, or – uh, how far are you with, it, with that? And is there a different approach with I'm, – I'm quite sure there's a different approach. I mean, you got Big K who's a puncher, and we've seen what you did with uh, Rum Nitty. So I don't know if your your uh, approach would be different. How different would it be versus Big K as opposed to Surf? Yeah, I'm not I'm – not, I, I have a lot of work to do. Um <laughs> I have a lot of work to do. I, I like I'm I, I don't know. I'm like a glutton for punishment. Like I, I just I, I just like for some reason seem to like to really stress myself out <laughs> and wait like wait too long. Like me versus Chilla, I I finished writing like an hour before the battle. Like oh just hell stupid, no just stupid shit. <laughs> hell yeah, no. like like and and I, and not like I was coming up with brand new material just like writing it. Like I don't I don't think I'm like a fast writer. But I just I have a hard time calling something done, and so I'm always editing and rearranging and like fuck like does, you know does this does this you know does this line really go into that line or does this one really go here like I don't know, so I probably have too much material for both of them, but it's just not it's not like dressed up yet you know what I mean? Okay, and 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 the the approach is different for both opponents. I'm I'm quite sure, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, because like I mean, K, like I don't think K is the villain that Surf is, and and yeah, he's a puncher, so he's gonna be like you even seen it with K versus uh, I mean with Surf versus Nitty, like even though Surf's first round is like electrifying, and I, I think I think like. I think Nitty is a better writer in a lot of ways than Surf, but but on yeah. that big stage in that in that first round, you did see the difference, right? You did see, like as much as anybody right. might hate Surf or, or dislike, you know, you once that first round happened, you're like, yeah, like I get it, I get it, you know what I mean? Um, but it wasn't every line. It took him a while to heat up, you know what I mean? So. And and it's that small room, like you you know what that room is like. It's a it's, it's a little it's right. a different. It's not going to be that. It's not quite the volume series, but it is a smaller room. Um, so there's a little more leeway to have a narrative. Whereas I think with K, like he's just, it's just exciting. It's just oh, you know, when he's at his best, it's like every every bar. It's like you. It's like it's a, it's just it's just a lot of energy and a lot of excitement where you can't really. You know what I mean? Like, right. You and Chilla, it's like once that once that Neo Matrix bar hits, you're like, fuck. Like, I don't really have too much real estate. I don't have too much real estate to like play with these lines. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. right, right. Like, you only have you know three minutes. You have forty eight bars or whatever it's gonna be. Like, you got to make the most. You don't really have a lot of room to be telling too much of a story without with without reaction. You know. 
also, also with uh, both like you're 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 in talks for for you know possible champion of the year, you know especially you pull both of these victories off. Um, is there anything further down the line that you're looking at? Because I mean. Like you take a name like Surf and you take Big K, it's like you know, like where where the fuck do you go after that? Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, is I don't know. Is there a possibility for for a newer cat to get Iron Solomon, or, or are we looking at Iron versus like Hollow or Lux or some shit? Or you know what what is in the what the future hold? Or you don't know yet? I mean, honestly, like to me, it's it's both, yo. Like I'm I'm having so much fun, and and like I said, like I'm not I'm not selling t-shirts, I'm not selling mixtapes, like so I don't have I don't have an ulterior motive except to great, you know, to try to try to do the best that I can do and prove, you know, just push myself and and contribute to the culture as much as possible. And before, you know, it's like you you look at someone like Mook or Hollow or Lux, like as much as they have earned this certain spot like they're also painted into a corner like like Danny you can battle as much as you want and it's not like you're gonna it none of it's gonna take away from your legacy like because that's that's how you right. set yourself up to be able to have that freedom like hollow lux Mook, right right as much you know they're, they're geniuses they're career strategy geniuses but they're also a little bit stuck they're, they're they don't have the freedom and to me I'm not really in that position. Like I, I'm trying to hold on to this moment so that I can really, you know, I think I, I would love to see those people cause they're, cause they're, they are the greats. And I want to, I want to be at that level. I want to, you know, get back to, to being, to be in there and being mentioned in those conversations like Lux, hollow, Tay rock, uh, Hitman, you know, the people who are big draws um, and, and not to include Hitman in that because he's, he's the worst the worst writer in battle rap, but just to say like the people who are, who are big like that, but then, but then on the flip side, like, yo, yeah, I, I dead ass like watch, um, I watch PGs, bro. I watch, uh, Coliseum. I watch a hat. Like, you know what I mean? Like we go hard. Like I watch, I watch all that shit. And like, I would want to, take a battle on one of those leagues and, and battle somebody that people don't really know like that. Like I'm a fan of like, I, I want to have, I want to have the freedom to be able to do shit like that. And I want to do it because I think it just makes it more interesting. Like, I think it's just, it's just healthy for battle rap and it's more interesting. And I'm not personally trying to rest on the history of what I've accomplished or whatever the fuck that is. I'm just trying to do, I'm trying to get in the trenches and do do this shit, yo. Like, I, if I if I'm a fan, I think shit is dope. Where I'm gonna be inspired by you, then I'm also like anyone I'm inspired by, I'm also scared of, and so that that makes me want to test myself. You know what I mean? Like, right. That's, so when that's I, when just I, the I, mark like, of a true MC. Yeah, exactly. Like that. It. I have the freedom to just be to just just do that to be that now. Like. It's liberating to not be tied to a brand or a marketing plan or this is my only source of income or whatever it is. It's just like, oh, now I can care about this in the way that I'm that I'm supposed to care about it because when I was when I was when it was my whole life in terms of my financial stability and and my ego and my passion, I was going on blogs and seeing you know, Kendrick is coming up and J. Cole and I'm like, fuck these dudes. And when I'm supposed to be like, this is somebody who I would stay up till four in the morning to tape Stretch and Bobito on the cassette and I still have a shoebox full of those cassette tapes like in That's the trunk awesome. of my car because I want, you know what I'm saying? Like, so how do I go from working so hard to find new music to now hating on new music that's being that I have easy access to because of the internet, because I'm struggling in this art form. It, it made it unhealthy for me. But now that I'm like, it's like being a kid when you're a kid, like you don't pay your bills with the shit. You don't, it, it's your escape from going to school, dealing with your neighborhood, dealing with your parents, dealing with home drama, dealing with your girl. Like right and now for me, it, I got to get back to that place of purity with it. And so I can go to Weco Hard or I can go battle on the Coliseum and 
feel the freedom of that and 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 turn around and get do me versus Lux on a volume or something. You know what I mean? Like you know that's, that's what dope, I want. Man. That's what I want. That's awesome to hear, you know, just from a fan and from a battler's perspective because somebody of your stature could easily be like, you know what, you know, I'm like God's here. I'm God's here. So, you know, I'm battling once a year and it got to be, it got to be Lux. It got to be hollow. If it ain't that, then fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Like you're still out here in the trenches willing to go and take, you know, whatever, whatever makes sense. You know what I'm saying? Especially if it's, in the in the realm of skill skill wise, you know what I mean, and that's just dope to hear somebody of your stature say something like that because we don't really get a lot of that. So that you know, shout out to you for that because yeah. I mean I've been standing for the, I've taken that same stance since I came in the game. You know what I mean, and I caught flat yeah. over like, oh damn, you battle this guy and you battle this guy, and it's like, but you know what, I'm putting on dope battles for the culture. I'm not sitting around waiting and one you time to come like, out. Like, I'll come out geez. the cave. Yeah. Yeah, Danny don't take days off, like, because he cares about it. Like, that's the thing is, like, a lot of people will be like, yeah, I'm going to go to this league for a check, and, and not that many people are going to see it, so I don't really need to go that right. hard, and I could just beat this guy easy off charisma and, like, seasoning. But, like, you care too much. I care too much. Like, if I, if I you know, when, when I do go to, to one of these, like, really small leagues and – somebody that people don't maybe don't really know about like I'm going to go super hard and try to have the best battle that that league has ever seen and and try you know what I mean like I'm right that, that's what it is to me like as you should it's because it's it's setting an example yeah, exactly. it's, it's exactly. just setting an example for the culture like exactly. this is how hard you're supposed to go like when y'all watch me versus exactly uh, St. Mike on the connects or you watch me versus Jose Cuervo that just dropped on Iron Mouth. It's like I go 100% no matter the name, no matter the league, because I'm just setting an example of what a battle rapper is supposed to do when you get contracted. Yo, and, and job. It's like as the, as the elder statesman, like for us in the game, like that's how it's supposed to be. Like I don't want to hear no fucking top tier OG veterans complaining about young cats don't understand this or don't don't understand the game if they're not setting a fucking example, you know what I'm saying? Like you can't you can't be out here complaining about shit if you're not not leading. Right. Right. You. Right. 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 Right.